Hello, I'm Gary Rays of Remax Integrity, and our market is changing. Are you ready to take advantage of it? And now back to our topic, the market is changing, and are you ready to take advantage of it? Well, there's three important changes that has taken place in our market in the last uh, several months, and of course, a lot of it is because of the virus scenario. So we're, let's talk about the first one. First of all, interest rates have dropped last year, and we were all excited about that, and we said, you know, it may change and go up. Well, the bottom line is it hasn't. It's actually gone down. Uh, the average rate last year was about 4.2%, and now they've dropped all the way down to about 3.2%. So they may creep up in the future, but historically, it's extremely low right now. So take advantage of that if you can. Do your part to lock in a low rate. And what you do, just because you get approved for a loan doesn't mean that you'll get the very best rate. You probably know that. You need to have two factors going for you, and that is your debt ratio and also your credit score. So to lock in the lowest possible rate, you need to improve your credit score and also decrease your debt. Change number two, the peak listing season has normally been around the January to May time when things start picking up again. Well, because of this virus scenario, the COVID-19, it has been delayed until basically May, June. So uh, we expect this peak now to be like June through August. And so uh, that's a little different than, than before. So don't panic. There's plenty of time to get in the market. By the way, I'm going to make this statement right now. It's not about the timing, about timing the market. It's about how much time you are in the market. And that's what I want to talk about mostly today. Lane County last year, over the year, we averaged uh, the, the price, the median price has gone from 285 to 320. This is a pretty steady increase. And we don't know what's going to happen in the future, but bottom line, I'm going to talk about the, as if it's continuing to go up. When's the best time to buy a house? Well, that's whenever you can, and I'll explain why. The housing market will always increase over time. There may be a drop here and there once in a while, but it'll always eventually go back up, and we're going to just assume that it's going to go up uh, at about the 5% per year uh, rate at this point in time, and that's just a, that's a guess. So if you bought a house for, say, 300000 with a mortgage of 1800 per month and to continue to grow at the 5%, this is what's interesting, you would generate $83,000 worth of equity in just five years. And that's just the appreciation. That is not counting the actual five years of payments that went on to the principal. So that went down as well, your principal. And also that's not counting your tax benefits that you receive from Uncle Sam from owning a home. So think about that. You've just, because you've lived in this house, you've now increased your equity at least $83,000. Now let's pretend that you rented for $1,800 a month for five years. You'd end up paying for that home, or for the, you'd pay the rent, the owner of that home, over $108,000. So once again, an old saying goes, it's not timing the market, it's the amount of time that you are in the market. And as, as you, anybody who knows me, I'm a proponent of home ownership. And that just gives you a big example of why you should try to get in, into a home as quickly as you can for lots of reasons. Okay, and that's my little spiel for this time. So until next month, this is Gary Rays at Remax Integrity. You can always give me a call or reach me through Gary Rays at Remax.net or call me at 541-554-5825 and I'll answer any questions that you have. Okay, you take care and stay safe.